Hello there everyone, it's a new Fortnite creative update day and uh, it's an alright update. I mean we got the Battle Royale Island, but um, it's not great. Let's read what's here. This island is a beta release. Build your own experience on the ever-changing Battle Royale map. Control loot, spawning and deployment options, storm options and use creative devices to customize your own Battle Royale rules. Note, now this is the important bit, this map will automatically update to reflect the latest version of the Battle Royale map. As a result, creators will be unable to edit the map itself. Monetization via supporter creator is currently disabled for islands using this starter island. So uh, we can't change anything, it looks like. Well, let's go ahead, make the island, and uh, we can see the thing here. Now, it's already loaded up, and apparently when we win this, we should actually start matchmaking. That's not the right description, but oh well. Yeah, you see, I just walked through it, and it's matchmaking instead. Now, hopefully we can see the creative menu, because uh, there is a couple changes there as well. Certainly taking it sweet time. Yes, yeah, so while we're waiting, in the new update, no new devices besides on this. Cancelled. Matchmaking cancelled. Try again. Do I have to stand in this? Finished. Ready. Check. Connecting. Queue full. In queue. Waiting for server. Very confused. <laughs> Does it not work? That would be a bit creepy. Okay, so it just keeps cancelling. Let's maybe reset creative mode. Hopefully that fixes the issue. What is this? Battle Royale Island plot. What? Look, there's Pickle Wreck. Very cool. Uh, let's play this then. Battle Royale Island plot. I've never seen that before. That's interesting. No image. Nah. Oh, big ol' error. Matchmaking error. Mm, kinda sus. Okay, let's try just going into creative mode then. Why don't I go onto Twitter and see if it's broken? Yeah. Okay, let's try this again, So 30 seconds BR. Matchmake. Still nothing. You can currently... Ah, okay, you can currently not enter the Battle Royale Island. Put you in the matchmaking and then cancels the queue. Oh man. Well, then we'll have to look at that later, won't we? Yeah. Okay then, let's go ahead and open up a different island. Okay, we'll get this island backed up because uh, it's my winter island thing again. But uh, let's go ahead and look at the new stuff. So we did get some new prefabs with a bunch of cube pieces. I mean, they're just like a year late, so it's all okay. Has it been a year? No way. Has it been a year since the cube stuff? But then we also got a bunch of galleries, and I'm sure you are seeing one cool one there. Let's just place these down. Wow, these are huge. Wow. Uh, wasn't expecting them to be this big. Okay. Well, let's place the galleries out first, sure. And then we can get these big old prefab. Okay, there we go. So prefabs nothing too special about them they're just the areas from the barrio map love this oh it's just one big cube okay then that's fine is this one little cube it's one little cube guys that's amazing it's still very nice to have all of these i mean look at this this is super cool looking very nice very very nice indeed and then you got the one here where it's got the big golden cube which is looking spectacular Guys, it doesn't it doesn't bounce. It doesn't bind. What? You're telling me you made the golden cube and it doesn't bind. Personally, I think I'm actually kind of okay with that, because look at this as a floor. You're telling me that's not a cool floor for a hallway? That's an amazing floor for a hallway. Loving that. Now is that its normal size or can it Yep, yeah, it's normal size. Okay. Here we are. Here's the cubes. Oh we got little tiny ones. Oh wow, we got little tiny cubes. None of them, none of them bind. What is this? What? This is like the new cab in the cube here. <laughs> what? Why you, Why no make binds? Huh? Um, okay, sure. Got some, well, not some, loads of gallery pieces here. And I mean, is this one piece? Like, this is one piece. Why? Why would we need that? You can literally grab this piece and do this. And you get the exact same thing. You ever design these? I mean, right. It's like literally the exact same. It's useless. Half of the things in this are useless. Why would you? <laughs> These are basically prefabs, bro. No, no, no. Don't like this. No, there's too much stuff going on. Ugh. I know for a fact that I will not probably be using any of these. I mean, I'll probably use some, but <laughs> those aren't great because I mean, we can literally make all of these with like this you know what i mean we don't need all of them we've got literally the cube piece here can they connect or do they uh z fight they z fight sorta 
It just looks like a wobbly wall. Um, the top. There's no Z fighting on the top. Okay, cool. Maybe it's because it's not lined up on the top, eh? Well, why you? Why do you not want to get lined up? Because it drops on, that's why. Oh, no, there's definitely the Z fighting on the top. And then we got the stairs and stuff. Very, very fun, so... Now, you might be like, okay, what else did we get? Well, we got this new section here, the Battle Royale device. And I thought maybe that means we get the new, like, loot pool devices and deployment devices, but um, it only shows these devices which is telling me that this probably means that these are the only devices we're going to be able to use within the Battle Royale Island, which is really unfortunate because it's not a lot. There's like barely any devices here. I mean, look at all the devices we have. Yeah, all of these here. And yet, these are the only ones we can use in the Battle Royale Island. I mean, this Battle Royale Island thing is starting to look really pathetic. <laughs> uh, nothing new. And the weapons, unfortunately, does not look like it, no. This has been reordered again, for whatever reason. Like, bro, can you not just leave it, no? Gonna have to get used to this again. So yeah, nothing new there. And then we got consumables. You might think, oh, the new, like, deployment supply drop thing will be here. But I went through, and I do not see it. So it'll probably come out later today. So I'm going to wait a while, see if they fix the island issue. And I will see you back when that happens. Okay, so we're back because uh, they did indeed fix the battle royale issue. Now, before we go into I just want to go into this island here because... Uh, I want to see if a couple new settings on some devices have been updated on all maps, or is it just the new Battle Royale Island? I also want to see if we can copy devices over to the Battle Royale Island, which we don't have access to on there. Now, the device is the supply drop device here, and uh, it has a setting here for Spawn Radius Island. Now, I don't know if that was there before, but it's there now, so that will randomly spawn within like a circle, a zone circle. Now let's go ahead and copy a device here, maybe the VFX one, player spawner, and maybe let's even copy a building just to see if any of them go through. Now if we go back to hub and we change the island, we can go to the battery island. And uh, I was messing around with it with uh, another person earlier. By the way, the portal does open instantly, but we walk on through and it starts to matchmake. Now, if you're playing with friends, the party leader must go through the portal first or else it will not work. Okay, so we're here and I know it doesn't look great it's because somebody, I know you're watching this, somebody destroyed a bunch of stuff. But um, what I'm noticing is that it's brought this back. So this platform they had destroyed. Now it looks like the building that was here has not returned, but um, the platform is definitely came back. That's cool. Yeah, that's cool. And they also had changed the size of this. So that's changed back to size. However, they're... <laughs> <laughs> that one's still stretched. Like, now you might be wondering, what is this big ball, Mr. Mobile? It's the zero point. Yeah, I may or may not find out how to get onto the island. Now, that's as small as you can make it, but uh, that's actually the normal size of the zero point. And then we can make it this size. Yeah, it's huge. It is a big boy. But anyway, I will show you how to get to the island. And it looks like the stuff in our inventory did also not come through. Now, we've got the new devices here. We have the loot controller the deployment console, the storm caller, and the map settings console. And you can also change it to the new event binding system. So you can enable bots, vehicles, and wildlife. With the storm one, you can set an amount of storm phases. You can only go up to 10, which is unfortunate, but you know, it's still 10. There is a weird bug at the minute with this, at least on my end, where after the first phase, the second phase shrinking, takes an hour so don't know what's going on there because uh you can change the times in here and i've only got it set to like a couple minutes all right yeah look at this resize times 120 but um and that's 60 so it's like i don't know what's going on with it the battle bus one you can do battle bus or rift rift presumably will just teleport you particular area on the map you can make a battle bus for every single team so i've made this world allow 100 players which means there is 100 buses in the sky it's amazing and you can change a whole bunch of settings in this you can change the speed and everything unfortunately only goes up to 100 but it's still pretty cool you cannot copy these devices and place more of them on your own islands and stuff which sucks and uh, this here the loot controller terrible device 
you can only change the loot to particular loot like explosives, shotgun, sniper, single shots, uncommon, blue, purple, legendary, and blue or better. Why is there blue or better? I don't know. And why is there like no just regular common? There's green, but there's no common. It's really, really weird. But you can set it to no loot as well and the percentages of all of those too. The device is down here. Now I've went ahead and made a little map and I will be giving it a code after this for you to check out. Now, before we do that, let's go into this house because I never actually went in here and there doesn't seem to be anything of importance, no. So I think what Epic's done here is they've made us this little platform, these two big squares here, so we can put our devices down on them. And if you notice, see at the top of your screen, there's no memory. Zero memory in this map and that's probably because you can't change stuff or so you think. I'm going to show you guys how you can change stuff in the Battle Royale Island. Now, these are the only devices if you go new this season, there's nothing here. Battle Royale device, these are the only ones you can use. So there's not a lot of choice, unfortunately, but um, still not a bad selection. Now, if you remember, 30 seconds to kill, I have changed this to 30 seconds to kill. So every 30 seconds, you get a completely random weapon. I will put some locals in that too that deal damage. And then you will also get a score to show who's in the lead. Now, before we go into how to get to the island, let's go ahead and just start the game and see what that's like. So you still get all the game settings and stuff, which is cool, like my island settings and all that. But you'll see the bots are joining the world. And uh, by the way, I don't know why, but all the seagulls go over here. I mean, look at them all. They're crazy. Can we pick them up? Doesn't look like it. That's unfortunate. But they're also way over there. It's just a couple of big patches of seagulls. And if you're like, oh, that's not the zero point, Mr. Mobile, where you, you got to put it underwater and it, it tries to make it look better but <laughs> okay here we go so if i open the map here you'll you'll see that there are 100 battle buses and when they start to move it's quite mesmerizing actually especially since like none of them go in the middle i think that's really weird that none of them will go near the middle they sort of just go around the side it's not just weird hey, look at that they're just going around in circles or so it seems optical illusions are fun everybody and then you get a wee message because i made that hey there mobile scrap every 30 seconds your weapon will change the player with the most eliminations wins and then it kicks you out of course weapon switch and such and such that's just my mechanics it's nothing to do with the map you can enable flying and everything like that too but to put it simply it's just a battle royale island and you can make basically your own LTMs and it's, it's quite it's quite cool I've got to be honest it's quite cool um one of the weird things is the bowlers don't sit right on like bolter devices they always are off them when you start the game and when you open scoreboard look at this crazy absolutely crazy in here all the all the target bots and anonymous target bots for whatever reason now the annoying part about this is all the target bots are literally the target skin i just broke your shield pal see it's just target skin and so is he hey there bud hey there we go but that's it that's literally the game and you can change all the settings to the way you like it and you can see there on the right now i've got three eliminations so it's definitely cool you can definitely play with your friends now if you like bots but let's end the game and let's show you the one big problem or to a lot of us would not be a problem it would be the best thing ever so when this mode got leaked everyone thought oh yeah we're going to be able to make our own pois and everything well we can't this is all we have access to we can't leave this box or anything like that but i have the zero point here so shouldn't you be able to leave it uh, yeah, yeah, you can. Let's just delete these because at the minute, I don't think that they have actually said if you do this, you will uh, get in trouble. But um, at the minute, you can like right click outside of this zone and pick up stuff. So you already can pick up quite a few items that you don't have access to. Um, but zero point. Let's go ahead and go into my island. It's right in here. If we go to tools, no, not tools, description, and we click set photo. Oh, look at that. Nothing happened. I actually can't even get out of fly mode. Let's click E. We did a wee minute. And look at that. We're now at the island and um wait why is it not giving me my phone did they fix it well anyway i mean we can go into the battery out island here or not i need my phone sure i need my phone what if i respawn will that just I, that i presumably will just take me back to that island area yeah yeah well okay let's try something else then let's actually keep the phone out 
and do my island set photo and we'll do right there and i did hear it yeah it like it doesn't give us a phone anymore so they've already fixed it wow okay lucky me still got the zero point though <laughs> so originally um you would get the phone with you i don't know why i'm not so it does look like they may or may not have actually patched that wow already too that's quite quick yeah that's super weird why is it not doing the thing that's really annoying me now i was gonna do a whole video on where i try and customize like tilted or something wait what if i launch myself upwards i don't know we'll try this one more time if we can't then well, i guess i'm the only person with a zero point <laughs> Yeah, I got the zero point. No one else does. Haha. Uh -huh. You can also pick these balloons up, and uh, they also are unreleased too. But they're bouncy. Look at this bouncy balloon. Very cool. No one will be able to get up here anyway in the actual game. So it's pretty cool. Now you might be asking, what about these devices? Some of them are incredibly useless. For example, the bouncer. Where are we going to put that if we can't go on the map? That's a good question. What about the billboard? I guess just for planning stuff out, but no one's actually going to be able to see that in the game. Same with the player reference. Same with the real time clock. I mean, you're not going to be able to make live events, are you? So there's no point doing that. And there's just some devices like a timed objective and stuff. I guess you could use them for certain mechanics, but uh, it doesn't make a lot of sense. But let's go ahead and try this phone thing one more time where we just fly up no it doesn't look like it's gonna work oh but i do have bouncers and uh, i can build no so i got infinite materials i suppose though we technically could enable flying in my island settings right like we could go all the way down here player flight Oh, yeah. You just got to watch out for the death barriers. Mm-hmm. A lot of those around this map. So, yeah, it's cool. You can enable flying and stuff and all of that there. But uh, I'm probably going to have to just duplicate this island and, well, the mechanics off it because uh, they're probably not going to like it. Why is this not falling? Is it because it's on the barrier? Yep. Yeah. Um, Because they probably don't want me having the zero point, like, and I don't think anything happens if I jump on it. No. I don't know why they haven't given us this, but there are a bunch of things out there. If you can find out how to get the phone, because I completely forgot. And I cannot get out of the box, which really sucks. I could use bouncers to get out. I don't really know. But anyway, that's everything, everybody, in this little update. If you find out again, I'm going to just put some video gameplay of the map. You can go on and stuff because I was playing earlier. I'll show you that footage now. And before we do go ahead and show you that footage... Um, they did add another new thing, sort of like an overview. It's another, yes, yet again, another um, sort of scoreboard screen thing. So now we've got scoreboard, career, map, uh, player, or NPCs you've ran into for whatever reason. You don't need that. I don't know why they've given us that in creative mode. And now, overview, which is completely useless, by the way. Well, not completely useless, but it's pretty useless. So to get this, you're going to have to go into a map and you'll have to be mapped with a code and you'll have to load into that map with that code. Now we're in my map here and um, if we open up the map, you'll see this overview and uh, it basically gives you this whole big amount of information. It gives you the information of the game. It gives you the favorited and the like thing. I'm going to like this because it's pretty fun and then miscellaneous, but it's only got respawn. <laughs> so, uh. Why you got miscellaneous, I don't know. But um, we then also got like the code, the name, all these things along here too. And that's basically that. But now let's go ahead and show you me going around the island with the phone. Yeah. Okay, let's see. Can I pick up the rock statue? And the answer is no. No, I cannot. Oh, what about the Herald stuff? Can I pick that up? I can pick the Herald stuff up. Does it have like the... Oops. <laughs> Try, but what about the, the Star Wars thing? <laughs> <laughs> okay back well i mean you can't get banned for something until they say oh if you do this you'll get banned okay there's the zero point we can copy the zero point oh it only gets that like cool glowing effect when you put it under the water what about the bear yeah maybe no oh i, I copied something whoops uh -oh. I, I placed like a speaker down somewhere oh well they'll not notice that oh but everything's like not rendered in like what? Oh, I can pick up the stalactites and stuff from in the cave. We will be the big peely. I can pick up the big peely. I, I, this upsetting. I can't put it in my inventory. Oh, well, yeah. All right, let's try this Death Star thing. Where is it? Over here. Oh yeah, over here. And since I'm on fears, oh wait, I just lost my phone. I like, oh, I got it back. It was like a. 
a barrier, you know, like before they... Yeah, this is like maybe five or six times bigger than the Thermal Island. I don't think I will be able to pick this up. Oh, wait, I could put my speed up to like 10. Oh, I died. Um, yeah, I'll try that one. I probably can. Oh, you know, um, can't pick up the giant rock. Um, I can pick up the eyeball of the robot. It's actually a really cool piece. Look at that. It's just like a black cracked ball. Oh, yeah. Imagine the... I'm actually going to use this as a thumbnail. Me just flying around on the creative island. Yeah. Um, like what else? For some reason, the lighthouse is now in Condo Canyon or Cloudy Condos. <laughs> okay. Um, I went over to the blimps. It wouldn't let me. Oh, wait, what about the bird barn stuff? Oh, I can, I can pick up the, uh, the hologram thing. At least though, you can't, it, it's like not in the actual island. So you're not going to be able to bring this stuff to like your own creative island no i couldn't I couldn't copy it i think it's because it's maybe part of the i am actual prop uh, whoa <laughs> um where was like the shark thing you said or oh, you just mean like the big like rock i thought we already have that no i can't pick it up oh there there's a boulder here and it's not even like on the device i can place this boulder wherever i like and it's got physics and like i can only bring it a certain distance it's just destroying everything now okay um the other one i wanted to try was the desert version if it's still a thing i can find one there we go so if i copy this one am i able to break it yeah i can i can break it and copy it and like paste a whole a whole bunch of them <laughs> that's amazing uh, let's just delete these because uh don't want to get in no trouble what about zip lines i can pick up zip lines oh it's just the end frame part it's not the actual zip line what if i enter the zip line nothing now i'm just casually walking on the island very nice the drill uh, it loads in no can't pick it up so i'm here at, like this new location where like log jam used to be and it, it's starting to get taken over by chrome but if i go far enough away it changes the whole place to a crew to what it'll look like. <laughs> oh man, they left that in there. Oh, you know what we need to see if we can copy? The TV walls. We can copy the TV walls in the Rave Cave. Best wall in the game. What is this thing? It's like huge. Why? Hmm? Ooh, no. Can't pick it up. Can I go in it? Nothing on the other side. There is these really cool stalactites. Look at these. Cool. I don't think there's much else to discover though. Big track. Oh, oh. Oh, no, I can't. It doesn't have the effect on it. Oh, okay. Okay. Very interesting update. 